Nothing quite works up an appetite like a good exorcism. <laughs> now, it's been a couple moons since I put out the last video, uh, mainly because I've advanced in grade and now my daily practice has almost doubled, which leaves me very little time for other things. I've also taken on other work on top of it. And so I needed to get acclimated to the new practices so essentially I could do them in my sleep. And so that's where my focus has been as of late. Now a side product of that has been a shift in attention towards ridding my space of negativity, uh, both inside and out. I'm not going to go so far as to say that I was under attack. Um, however, things had occurred and my health had suffered a hit and I was having things happen such as dark splotchy marks appear on my body and and to where the dermatologist even said, oh, I don't know what that is. <laughs> Which is something you don't want to hear from your doctor is, I don't know what that is. I can tell you what it's not, but I, as for what it is, I have no idea. And so it was time to break out the uncrossing ritual. Which is well known within hoodoo and Wiccan circles. However, not so much in ceremonial magic. However, having gone through it a couple times myself now, I would say that it is essential. It is absolutely essential. Now, I did the traditional seven-day uncrossing ritual, and by the seventh day, those dark splotchy marks on my skin, whoosh, gone, completely disappeared. You'd be surprised at the things that this one ritual can remove. <laughs> 